This weekend, student athletes, coaches, and athletic staff put on their Sunday best and gathered together in the Humble Center to celebrate and honor athletic achievements at GC's most prestigious event, the Leafies. Erica Albertine, athletic director at Goshen College, loves the celebration and how it represents all that the department did as a whole. So the Leafies is really modeled after the SBs uh, on a little bit of a smaller scale, but we try to make it just a really celebratory event. All things from athletic excellence to academic excellence to community engagement. Uh, and I think the biggest thing is unity is one of the core values of the live uh, full that we have in the athletic department. So faith, unity, leadership, and learning. Coaches nominate their athletes with the vote then being held to decide winners. For the recently graduated women's basketball player, Emily Brandeberry, the Leafies are the perfect time to celebrate a season of hard work. I think the Leafies is a great way to bring everyone together since we don't always get to watch one another play each other's sports if we're all doing our own practices or other things. And the winner of the Ruth Gundon Award is Emily Brandeberry. <laughs> This, this is a really big deal because one, Ruth Gundon was the first women's basketball coach uh, from 1958 and she passed away unfortunately this past year. So it's a really big deal. Um, throughout my time through the women's basketball program, Coach Miller has really always um, brought her up and how important she is to women's sports in general. No stranger to winning Leafies is Rustin Nice, who coaches cross country and the distance runners for the track and field program. He has twice been honored with the Coach of the Year Award and was again this time around, but with a small twist. And the winner of the Coach of the Year, oh my goodness, it's both of them. I was co-coach of the year with Luke Wagner, yeah. Nice shared the spotlight this year, but to him the award was more of a reminder of what the team has been through and what they are capable of. So I've won it twice before, and this year it matters to me more because of what the team did. After we lost Ezra in October, they, they kept showing up for each other and they put themselves in positions to be academically and athletically successful, but more than that, they took care of each other. And so to, to achieve this, to me, signifies what the team is and what they do. And so this is it's not my award, it's, it's for them. Nice's message is a reminder that there is more to the title of student athlete than just being a student and just being an athlete. It's also about being a part of a team and a community as well. Reporting for Globe Sports, I'm Seth Smith-Kaufman.